questions. In this video, we are gonna talk about the OXO Good Grips Pop Cereal Containers. So yes, this happened. I actually bought these OXO Good Grips Cereal Container. My boys, they love cereal. And I actually started eating tons of Cheerios because my cholesterol is so high. And they were complaining that the cereal was going stale so fast. Okay, let me show you what we were using before. Ta-da! They're not that bad, okay? One thing that went through my mind when they started complaining about how stale the cereal was getting is that maybe you should eat the cereal faster. So the first thing I want to talk about is how much these things are. I think OXO pop containers are so darn expensive expensive on the OXO website it was about $22.99 I ended up buying it through Bed Bath & Beyond but let's go ahead and dive into this so these actually come in three sizes the first size is a 2.5 quart the second size is a 3.4 quart and the third size is a 4.5 quart and this is the biggest one they have the 4.5 we wanted to get a cereal container that would actually fit our Costco size cereal boxes. Okay, so towards the end of the video, I will show you if it actually does fit. I want to start by first seeing how airtight this container is. And I think the test that I'm going to do is... I'm just gonna fill it up with water and flip it and shake it and see if there's any leak at all. Okay, so here we go. Here's the water in there. And I am gonna give it a good toss. But for the sake of being safe, I do not wanna make a mess. Let's put a little bit of insurance right there. Okay, so here we go. Let me make sure it's nice and sealed. Boom. Ooh. That's holding up pretty good. That's fine. I believe that some reviews were saying that it was keeping their cer cereals uh, nice and crunchy. And some people were saying that for how much they spend on cereals that they should be able to have it nice and crunchy every morning. And I completely agree. Nobody wants stale cereal. And let me show you how it works. So it has a rubber gasket around it right here. One of the cons of this container is that it is not dishwasher safe. The only thing that's dishwasher safe on these things is the rubber gasket. And you can take this completely out and um, put it in your dishwasher. Or you can just hand wash the whole thing. Uh, but yeah, I think that's what keeps it nice and tight around the seal here. So push it down and it should keep it nice and tight and it's almost the same as their oxo pop containers uh the series that they have it in a sense where you can use one hand opening and closing it and pouring it out so that's kind of like their thing right here on the top you can see that there is a little bump and that's what you want to push so it did take a little bit of effort on my part uh, by doing that. It's a pro that you can use it. You can use the whole thing with one hand, right? It's a pro. You can totally do that. But I think for little hands, like two-year-old hands, this would be really difficult. But I mean, does your two-year-old pour their own cereal? I'm not sure. My kid's 11 years old. I've forgotten all about um, little tiny hands, but yeah, I could just see that that it would be difficult for them to open this cereal But that might be a great thing because you can keep your little hands away from These little containers so they don't make a mess Also, these things are actually BPA free which is really good and the other pro that I want to discuss uh, that I think justifies the price of OXO containers is that they have an amazing warranty. One of my YouTube viewers name is Mr. T Shark Boy and he told me about the amazing warranty that OXO has. You don't even need a receipt 
if something is damaged or something's not working so just give them a call i will put the links down below as well if you would like to have access to that mr t shark boy was even suggesting that you find these containers in uh, goodwill stores or yard sales because you are able to call um, OXO for uh, replacement if something is indeed broken which is absolutely brilliant thank you so much for that comment now if you still don't think that prices on these things are justifiable then I actually reviewed a couple airtight storage containers on my channel please check them out and I think they're probably just as good as these containers if not better but they don't have the amazing warranty that OXO does provide so I am conflicted because I do like the warranty but I do not like spending $23 or so for one container I just think that's insane but check with me again in six months I will uh, put an update there to see if my cereal indeed stays super crunchy and fresh well I went ahead and gave them a wash and while I was drying them I just thought I'd give you a quick review on how easy or hard they are to hand wash I think that I have really big hands and it's um, a little difficult to turn your hands if you're drying them if you're married to somebody like Lou Ferrigno which I bet you his hands are huge then don't expect them to hand wash your OXO pop containers because it's just not gonna work out I'm so sorry to tell. anyways let's go ahead and give the Costco cereal challenge a try so here we go while i'm opening this i just wanted to check with you how are you doing and how's your cholesterol doing so here's a costco cereal size which is really hefty and we go through probably oh my gosh seems like one bag or two bags every week because it seems like my husband's always at costco buying more but that's all good. So let's see if this fits in a 4.5 quart OXO pop container. I had such high hopes and I thought it was gonna fit, but it was a little bit short. You're just gonna have to deal with it, so either don't buy your cereal at Costco or OXO Good Grips make a bigger one probably a 5.5 quart that would fit the Costco cereal well then there you go hopefully I was able to enlighten you on your wonderings about the OXO Good Grips cereal container before you actually make this purchase overall I think that they do serve their purpose but again i'll make you make your decision if you have any comments write them down below and i will surely check them out thank you again have a good day be blessed bye make sure to subscribe i hope you like the video i have no idea what this video is about